Hi, and welcome back to Chili Product Trials and Tribulations. This is episode number 72. Now, the first thing I gotta say is, is usually we have our, our super hots either when the digit ends in zero or in five. Now, if, if, if you recall back for, for episode 70, we had the, the bomb ghost pepper sauce, which was an interesting but not crazy hot. But then, in in show 71 is when I pretty much got slaughtered. Man, the seven pod Jonah. Wow, that was just torching. Um, uh, the pain in the throat, the, uh, the lack of focus on everything, the, the vibrating head, you name it, all of it. And, uh, so, and yeah, I'd say that that was the top three material of the hottest things we've had on on the program. But but today I I, I have another pepper, like I said I would, and this one I believe is a Fresno pepper. Now I don't know much about this, but but uh, I don't see a lot of people on YouTube re reviewing it so we'll see what happens now there's no way I can eat, eat this in one shot so I'm gonna take a few bites chew, swallow, and when I'm done with everything that's when I'll tell you what, what what's going on if I can <laughs> alright anyway here we go the, the Fresno chili pepper one All right, this one has kind of a rather sweet, watery, <coughs> excuse me, and fruity character. Uh, yeah, this is definitely one of the sweeter peppers that I've had. Um, yeah, it seemed like it had a lot of water and juice inside the chili. Heat building some, uh, some on the center of the tongue, the lips. Yeah. A very good flavor with this pepper. Um, I'd really like to try a sauce sometime made from this. The heat on this one in no way compares to the Seven Pot Jonah yesterday. Not at all. Man, that thing. Alright, let's put this into perspective. The Wicked Nightmare Chili Extract. That was about, I think it was tested at 2 million heat units. And of course, that blew everything else out of the water, but... I'd say the seven pot was maybe 1.1, 1.2 million. 
Man, that thing was nuts. This one, not doing that at all. The main thing I'm getting with the Fresno is a little bit of sweat on the top of my head and a nice front of the tongue and lip sting. Oh yeah. This one definitely getting those areas. Oh. I'm just glad that I didn't have to deal with anything like, like yesterday at all. This has good flavor. Very, very fruity. Much fruitier than, than other chili peppers that I've tasted. Much fruitier than, say, a jalapeno or a habanero. And certainly better tasting than that seven pot yesterday, which was m mighty floral and pungent. Oh. Compared to yesterday, this is very relaxing. Oh. This one seems to want to go more like for the front of my mouth in general. The uh, especially the top and bottom lip. However, I'm not going to go so far as to say it's a mild chili pepper, you know like the pepper and chinis, those Greek peppers you, you get in a salad, it, it, it's a lot hotter than that, but, but compared to, to yesterday's, this is nice and easy, 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 again, great flavors, and uh, don't really know what else to say about it. But uh, thank you for watching. And we'll we'll do one more pepper tomorrow, and and, and then we'll go go back into some sauces. And we'll see what happens with tomorrow's pepper. Anyway, take care. Bye.